What is up guys, Digital VFX here once again and I just woke up and I'm gonna wing this tutorial just to see how bad it comes out. But I literally woke up five minutes ago and I just went in to my computer room and clicked record. So this tutorial is going to help so many people out. Um, it is going to be on the best plugins that come with FL Studio and it's gonna be a little help on how to um, uh, put plugins in FL Studio. I'm not going to teach you how to download plugins because, I mean, whatever. I'm going to teach you how to make FL Studio recognize them. So if I find this one, this one is Miroslav Philharmonic. So as you can see in here, here are all the sounds and here are the um, files. I downloaded this from Torrent. And uh, so in FL Studio, you're going to go to Options, File Settings. And as you can see, I've rooted all these files. Um, so these are the files to get FL Studio to recognize um, all the different things. So right here, I have, let's see, where is it? Right here, Philharmonic. I click the little folder icon, so I'll do a new one down here. And I'll bring up the uh, folder browser, and then you can click where you um, put the file for the VST that you downloaded. And then once you click select and uh, once you click OK, you're going to go to Channels, Add One, and you're going to go to uh, More, and it'll bring up this. And then you're going to click Refresh and then fast scan and then that will bring it up here it will probably be in red and then you know you're good and sometimes you can exit out of FL Studio go back in and it should be there and you'll be set so to get into the rest of the tutorial um, as you can see I have a bunch of plugins here um, the three best plugins for just starting out Oh, not Nexus. <laughs> you probably don't have Nexus. Uh, is Citrus. As soon as I find it. And. What was the last one? FL Keys. Everyone says I don't have FL Keys. People, the, the name is Fruity Loops Keys. It comes with FL Studio. I've had so many comments saying, I don't have FL Keys. What would you recommend? It comes with FL keys, trust me. Um, unless, I don't know if the demo doesn't come with it, but I, I don't know. Alright, so, these are probably the three best. These all come with FL Studio. There's a bunch of people, like for 3 OSC, if you think that it's like not very good. Um, I think like Afrojack and David Guetta or Benny Benassi only use... Um, 3 OSC to make their sounds so starts out as a sound like that and then you can use all these oscillators to make your own sound I don't know much about it because I don't use it but I mean I've used it before and it's a really nice plugin if you're just starting and uh, I might make a video in the future on different trance settings and how to get them but there are millions and millions of videos on YouTube, probably not millions, but there are many, many videos on how to make different sounds from 3 OSC. so go check them out. I might make one in the future, but I'm not going to worry about it now. So second FL Keys. If you check my Avicii style video, um, you will see some good settings on here to make it sound a little bit better. Or you can check out a video that um, one of these kids, uh, Halo DNL, I think his name is, put up um, about a tutorial I made for him. Uh, I'm not sure if it's up yet, but by the time I put this video up, it will probably be up. So it goes over how to make um, FL keys sound really nice just from this. It makes it sound a little bit more deep and realistic. So, get that out of the way. Citrus is probably one of my favorites because you can make so many sounds just like 3OSC and it comes with so many presets. 
so you uh, operate all these and uh, you go through the filters and effects and it comes with a bunch of presets starts out as an orchestra setting or you can put it to default which is this um, and as you can see I made a preset right here called Dead Mouse. That is a setting I made from the default, which is as I just showed you. Um, that default setting, uh, you can change all the oscillators and make your own sounds. You can change these. So as you can see, if I go to here. Click that. Whoops. So, if you want to know how to make that dead mouse sound, you can check out my tutorial on how to make a dead mouse style pluck. Um, that just goes through how to use some of the basic tools in Citrus. So this video just went over how the or the three basic plugins that come with FL Studio. Uh, I know this video will help a lot of people out because people have been asking so many. They're like, I've had so many comments like, "Oh, your videos are amazing, but I don't have any of your plugins." It, you don't need the plugins to make good music. Like just like I said, Afrojack and a bunch of other people use just 3 OSC one that comes stock with FL Studio to make their sounds so I hope this helped remember to comment rate subscribe and this has been digital VFX production and thanks for watching